Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have been urged to make 2024 their year of reflection as insiders claim the Sussexes will be making a commercial comeback. Panelists on Talk TV were discussing the news that the Duke and Duchess are reportedly in extremely high demand and are being courted for speaking engagements and entertainment collaborations. However their plans were not popular with everyone, as it was suggested they instead choose to focus on silence and give King Charles a break. Give us a break. Give themselves a break. The release of Harry's memoir Spare on January 10 made for a rocky start to 2023 and according to the show was quite a lot for the royal family to stomach. Now with numerous new creative projects said to be in the pipeline, including a possible book from Meghan and new TV shows for Netflix being produced, it has been pointed out that the couple may need to play on their proximity to the firm to generate publicity. Stay up to date with the latest royal news join us on WhatsApp our community members are treated to special offers, promotions, and adverts from us and our partners. You can check out at any time. More info this led to some disagreement on the panel, as one commentator urged them to stop throwing bricks back at the UK while another acknowledged their royal connection helped to keep them relevant. When they announced they were stepping down as working royals in 2020, the Duke and Duchess claimed they wanted to be able to bring up their children away from the spotlight. Their statement at the time in part read, We now plan to balance our time between the United Kingdom and North America, continuing to honour our duty to the Queen, the Commonwealth, and our patronages. This geographic balance will enable us to raise our son with an appreciation for the royal tradition into which he was born, while also providing our family with the space to focus on the next chapter, including the launch of our new charitable entity. Become an Express Premium member Support Fearless Journalism Read the Daily Express online. Advert free Get super fast page loading Start 30-day free trial However, Queen Elizabeth would not accept this half-in, half-out approach and instead strip them of their royal patronages, although they retain their titles. Although the couple prematurely lost their deal with Spotify earlier in the summer, after just one series of Meghan's podcast archetypes, they still have their contracts with Netflix and Penguin Random House. It has been reported that Harry and Meghan are set to be producing a film adaptation of the novel Meet Me at the Lake by Carly Fortune for the streaming platform. Sources have also claimed that the Sussexes have nothing more to say about the royals and they are done looking back on their past life.